man. Y'all already know what time it is, man. The mic is red. That means this news is piping hot. So we not going to hold back. We going to money on the flow. Let's get straight to it. Now, listen, y'all might have already heard about it, but I didn't because I literally just got in the house, got off work. I mean, I'm building out the data center. You know, I have to do the, the networking thing. When you're the networking guy, man, you're the last one to show up. You have to work behind everybody. And a lot of times, it would have just been a lot easier if you had been in the know the entire time. But that ain't what we're here to talk about. What we're here to talk about is the culture changing. And the culture has officially changed because Coach Prime just posted this. But before we get started, make sure y'all like the video. Comment y'all thoughts down below, man. We just trying to get this thing going to the moon, Alice. And if nobody told y'all this today, man, y'all my brothers, my sister, my family. Love each and every last one of y'all. Just, hey, listen, this is what we got. Yin Yang Twins, halftime, stand up, get crunk, featuring Home Y. So listen, man, hey, y'all already yin yang in this thing. Listen, we already know that this is like we all we have, like we said a couple of weeks ago. We know the game is sold out. It's sold out ahead of the schedule, just like my guy Chris said, man. You know, it's, it's sold out ahead of the schedule. This is about the time that we thought it was going to sell out. So that's done. Let, hey, we're going to play this right here. And then, you know, we're just going gonna to get right uh, right back into it, man. Because, hey, listen. Hey, so look, man. We already know right now. Hey, we coming. Like, that's something that he's made a household slogan, man. But listen, 10 days out from the game. The game is sold out. We know it because Chris, he, he already predicted it. He thought it was going to be, you know, around about this time or real close to this time, you know, but they they, they almost sold it out a month in, ahead of schedule. We know that the celebrities uh, want to be there. We know everybody in the 90s. Like I said, it's just the new oldness, man, because uh, everybody in the 90s was with Colorado, with, with Rashad Salam. Everybody was with Cordell Stewart, Michael Westbrook. Hey, all these guys, man, everybody wanted to be a part of what was going on in Colorado back then, man. So listen, hey, you even got legends like Big Van Vader, a.k.a. Leon White. Hey, listen, man, it goes all the way back. But listen, I don't know if it's the black and gold or, you know, the color scheme or just, you know, how they how those guys played or just how Cordell was in Darien Hagen was magic, you know, when they played and, you know, did that thing. But everybody wanted to be a part of that. And it looks like we're going a long way with Coach Prime being there. Everybody wants to be a part of it again, man. All we got to do, go out there, put out a good show because you're going to be on ESPN by yourself, yin yang in that thing at halftime. And I just got to go out there and win some football games, man. Hey, it is what it is. And I'm here for it. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section, man. I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. Hey, it's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Temp. Guys, please.